It's the Christmas Countdown 2016. Hello, so here it is, Christmas Day, the last episode of the series. It could be the last Christmas for, for any of us really, so make sure it's a good one. And make sure when you're opening your presents, eating your dinner, I say this every year, pulling your crackers, wearing your hats, having a laugh with your family. Some people aren't lucky enough for that. Some people don't get presents to open. Some people don't get Christmas dinners to eat. Some people don't have family to pull crackers with. Some people don't have family to have a joke with. Some of us, I think every one of us, takes it for granted around Christmas. But please, think of the soldiers, the homeless, the people mourning over their loved ones dying. Family members, mums, dads, sisters, brothers, uncles, aunties, granddads, grandmums. You know, just think. Not all of, not everybody's as lucky as us. I think I've even taken Christmas for granted before. Because I never thought, you know, anything could go wrong. Because I was only young. But it turns out I was completely wrong. I mean, I say it every year. But please think, everybody. I mean, Brendan O'Carroll this week. Amazing man. If you don't know who he is, he is Mrs. Brown out of Mrs. Brown's Boys, isn't he? I don't know why I said London there, because he's, he's Irish. From Mrs. Brown's Boys, he is Mrs. Brown. Uh, but anyway. <coughs> this week he has donated <coughs> Christmas dinners. 2,800 families. I mean, a round of applause for that man. It's amazing. I wish more people, more people in this world were like him. At my school, where we go, we donate tins of food and shoe boxes full of gifts for uh, children uh, and homeless people and soldiers and all that sort of stuff. And it's a great feeling that we have helped people this Christmas. I can't say it enough. Please just think when you're eating your Christmas dinner. Please just think when you're opening your Christmas presents. Please just think when you're pulling your crackers. Please just think when you're having fun with the family. Some people aren't as lucky as you. And I want to leave on one more thing. I want to thank everybody. Every one of you. Even the arseholes that ripped the shit out of me for doing this. I want to thank everyone for taking their five minutes tonight, except day 18, 19, 20, 21 and 22 when I was off ill. I want to thank everybody for taking that time to watch my Christmas countdown. I know it's probably not the best. I know it's definitely not the best. But I try because I like Christmas. And I wanted to give everybody out there a bit of Christmas spirit. The best way of spreading, spe spreading Christmas spirit to sing loud and clear for people to hear. Well, I hope this year I have sung loud enough for all you. So from me, have a very Merry Christmas and I'll be back in the new year for my New Year Spectacular. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas. Ta-da.